What's shaking, everyone? My name is Benny Gooch. Welcome back to the Factory SBR YouTube channel. So as you can tell, we are not at Factory SBR today. We are at Arizona Speedway. This is my very first look at Arizona Speedway. Arizona Speedway it seems pretty big. Um, not as big as I thought it was going to be, especially watching on Flow Racing and watching the Wild West shootout last weekend. It looked like a really big track, lots of lanes. But after being here in person, it's really not that big of a facility. Uh, it's a lot smaller in Elma, Washington, up in Grays Harbor. And uh, I think it looks pretty cool, though. So we rolled in around 5.30 a.m. last night. I probably got like five, six hours of sleep all combined after waking up today. Probably a good, you know, seven, eight hour sleep with periodic breaks in between. But we're feeling good and alive today. So this is it. Um, I think this place looks pretty cool. I've been to Arizona before, but never to a racetrack. And uh, just as I expected, just big Rocky Mountains all around and uh, pretty dusty with desert all around it. But I like it. It's a cool place. We can walk up here a little bit and you can see all the vendors. So our hauler is right there, actually. And we're waiting to go in right there. We're waiting to go in around 12 is when they open it. And then they're going to start parking us in the spaces they'd like. Really cool facility with all the parking spaces and whatnot, but you can see we got some vendors behind us. We got Shots trailer, the Tony Stewart racing trailer, and then um, I think a couple food or shirt vendors over here. And then, and we got a bunch of campers over there. There is a dirt bike track right next to us, and that's what all those campers are. We thought they were fans at first, but um, looks like a lot of dirt bike races might be going on here too. So this facility is gonna be very eventful and very packed this weekend. It's going to be a lot of fun, and uh, this is day two. All we have on store today is Tanderson to go out for a good amount of hot laps in the 410. I think this is going to be one of the most perfect tracks to get your feet wet in a 410, and uh, I'll update you guys as the day rolls on. We got the big bull. You. All right, we got our spot. Looking good. VP trailer. Well, what are your thoughts? This place is pretty big. Uh, it's not the biggest track we've ever been to, but it has a lot of banking. So that's gonna, I think that's where a lot of people talk about how fast this place is. It's because of the banking and how wide it is. So. Should be interesting, looks smooth. As long as it stays smooth, it should be fun. Yeah. Yeah, we got the VIP seating over at the mud drag track. Not very muddy. Shoot, we might have to come out here and rip this. The mud drag track, real nice with the VIP seating. And then, I think I may have just got a Christmas gift here. Hell yeah. That's a good right rear. Shoot, this probably came off Superman's car. Y'all see this? That's a good tie right there. A little, a little ha hammer action. We're gonna take that bad boy home. <laughs> Sick signs. Carly, what are your thoughts? Looks good. Looks good. Got the got the bag of spits. Cracked pepper. Okay, okay. Carly's a fantastic driver. Alright, Austin Austin Powers. Hey, how about we take this to the motocross track? Yeah. Carly, what do you think? We should. Or the right. go-kart track. Yeah? Where's the go-kart track? To show us. We haven't seen it. We saw the mud bogging track. VIP seats, free tire. All right, here we are. Factory yard SBR approved. This is the cart track. What are you thinking? Dude, I think we need to make a lap around it at some point. This deal right here is so dang flat and you're, you can probably haul the mail around the top once you get some grip down, get some water on top. 
But the thing that scares me is if you miss this corner, you get right rear, you're going right off this into this and you're hopping the fence. You're going for an absolute sale, but Carla, what do you think? We make the trip out here and run the cart sometime? Yes. Yeah? yeah All right. And we got the motor cross track over there. Arizona Speedway, Motorsports Park. All right, so we're up here, track side, checking it out. I think it's a pretty cool track. Um, some big names. I'm waiting for the water truck to come by because it'd be cool to get some shots of it on the track. They just watered it, so uh, it's pretty sticky right now. I think we're going to get ready to roll the track here soon. Pretty shortly, I'm going to try to shoot some shots of Tanner. I don't know if I'll be on the infield or not. Um, just depends, like, what they allow or whatnot. But, uh, no, this whole facility is cool. Yeah, I'm looking back because I don't want the water truck coming by if I'm in the way. But, no, this whole facility is cool. I like it. Um, they got the cart track. They got the dirt bike track. They got the big track. Um, not really much more. You dra uh, The dirt drags, all you could really do is start getting into the asphalt stuff. But, uh cool track definitely some cool names here we got tony stewart donnie shots uh cory Lyson, just a bunch of big names lance deweese uh so y'all will be able to watch this on flow racing tonight's only a practice night and then i think after the practice night there's going to be like a, a pit party i'm gonna go to try to get some cool clips of that watch some people get a little rowdy but um yeah i think it's just gonna be fun dj netto's pulling in another big team yeah i think we're gonna be looking pretty good here all right, so I'm down here. Check this thing out. We got some, I think you'll be able to see it better here. Look at this. We got the reverse stagger on the old O1. Woo, scoop nose. Look at that block. That's old school, baby. Seat. Look at this thing. Now these cars are always in kind of like bad condition, but what's cool about them is you get to go look at them and uh, that's just kind of how it was back in the day. I mean, look at their equipment because back in the day, that was the best equipment at the time. And then now obviously it's outdated, but uh, looking at these old cars that I think are just show cars or whatever that they keep in the like vending area. Um, pretty cool to check out, but yeah, this thing's old old school for sure. I think they, uh, they're running a little bit too low of air pressure in the right rear and the plug wires are off. Probably not going to be the fastest setup, but hey, I bet you will turn laps. Ew, look at this thing. That's classic, baby. So we're in the vendor area. Nothing's all the way open yet. Uh, I think they'll open more tomorrow, but we got Tony Stewart's rig, Donnie Schott's rig, Tim Kading's rig over here. Whole bunch of things which is cool the big bull like you guys saw earlier but lots of people here now uh, lots of food vendors i think are still coming but we're just gonna keep going and checking them out it's always fun to just walk around facilities for the first time not knowing what the heck's going on here's all the dirt bike stuff all these rvs and stuff porta potty row over here yeah i don't know not that many people in the like stands areas and I think that's because it's just a practice night. And I don't know how long we're gonna go for, but we're supposed to have live music here. I think the live music's gonna be over here or something. So I'm going to the top of the stands in turn four to show you guys the motocross track. And to be honest, I think these are all fans that are campers here. But here it is. Pretty cool facility. Look at the shot up here. Looks phenomenal. And the weird thing is too is um, we we're supposed to get weather this weekend. So we we're almost not gonna make the drive down. I don't think you could really ask for better, better weather right now. So fingers crossed that it stays this way. Yeah. Just a racetrack out in the desert. Dude, these guys are gnarly. These guys are spinning around in crap over here. Wow. Ew.
it uh it was just smoking obviously it was the over that's just the overflow yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. so i just couldn't see for a little bit it kind of got me right You're at a pretty cool track when that that's happening to your front wings. Yeah. So Tanner went out for his first session. Uh, he thought it was pretty good. Yeah, you saw that the paint was getting used up there a little bit. It was fun watching him. And then I came back here, grabbed the camera, and we just shot some clips, and uh, it's pretty much what we do. Keep on rolling. Awesome. Your second. All right, everyone, that's going to end it for today's video. I hope you guys like exploring Arizona Speedway. The track work is coming in. We got Tanner here. So, final thoughts? What a bunch, uh, what a bunch of fun. I mean, getting around this place, like, we are absolutely flying. Ben and I were just watching some of the footage back. Like, if you sit in the grandstands and watch how quickly we are entering these corners, it's nuts. You've never been oh, to a 410 yeah. sprint car race. Highly recommend checking it out. It's, uh, it's the most high horsepower car you'll ever watch. Absolutely. So, with that said, as I always say, just because it's a shitbox don't mean it ain't fast. My name's Ben Agush, and I'll see you all in the next video.